Hi everyone, I'm Mary with Mary Greeley News. Thank you for joining me. Here's an update what's going on at Yellowstone. Today is Monday, President's Day, February 17th. Uh, you have the buffalo been wandering around there. The steam's a little dark and it's windy, trying to snow there. You see the dead tree line we got here. And let's look at what's been going on. They haven't reported any earthquakes for the Yellowstone area since the 14th. Uh, they reported five there in the park on the 14th. Steamboat Geyser went off on February 12th. It was uh, 10 days, 20 hours, and 16 minutes. Before that, it was February 1st, 9 days, 2 hours, and 42 minutes. Right now, it's 17 degrees Fahrenheit at the park. It's supposed to get down to minus 13 degrees Fahrenheit. Yeah, and I've talked about how we got the increase in melt of the snow on the ground. I'll bring this over for you so you can see it. You can see here the last date was the 14th and there was five earthquakes, the largest being a magnitude 1.5. But just because they're not reporting them doesn't mean they haven't happened. They are reporting 55 earthquakes for the entire week on this map location. There was a whole series of earthquakes. You can see them here. This one looks like the largest. I highlighted it at 154 um, Universal Time. That is today, the 17th. Let me pull that over. See that up there? 217. Any earthquake, if it was over a magnitude 2.5, would automatically be reported by the um, computer. So these are probably smaller. And being President's Day, they're not in there to report on these earthquakes. We got another small one right there. Um, looks like two of them. Two more there. Another one there. Another one there. This one is red, meaning it was supposed to come to the attention of the uh, geologist. They were supposed to look at it. We got a series of three here two more there another one in red that's 158 and about 45 seconds and then we got another one right here on um, 203 and 45 seconds let's look at the signature a little blip there this one too just a small microquake but see this one's a little bit more significant and then we got another one down here. These are all today. Um, look at the signature. Yeah, this is the line of melt pockets of hot rock and gases that comes up with these earthquakes. Not all rock melts at the same temperature. I keep repeating that. Kind of like a holes in the sponge or a sponge. And this is what it was showing when I pulled the files a little while ago. Yeah, and we got see how the heat's rising up today yeah let me go back up over here I pulled it back going all the way to uh, Friday I believe this here is the 16th um, today is the 17th this is at 143 and 10 seconds universal time um, like I said they haven't reported anything since the 14th yeah, we got a whole series here. Look at this. This was yesterday. And we got some really tiny stuff. Let's go up a little bit farther. Did I mention that this is the borehole for Yellowstone Lake? And Yellowstone Lake's been showing increase in activity and uplift and uh, spreading there at the uh, fault line that runs through the lake. Their actual scientific term for when you see signatures like these is blobs of magma. Yeah, harmonic tremors. And then prior to when these were happening, we got another earthquake there, 1709. None of this is being reported, and this was yesterday. Yeah, a lot of heat coming up there at Yellowstone. And we got another little earthquake there. Another one there. None of these are being reported. When you have significant earthquakes like this here at Little West Thumb and Yellowstone Lake showing up on multiple monitors, 
down here. I actually pulled panther for you today. Um, yeah, you know it's an earthquake. It's not a um, <laughs> some kind of bump that interfered with the monitor. And and this for Yellowstone Lake is a borehole. It's a very deep well. Here we have that other earthquake at both monitors uh, just after midnight. This is today. Here's the other earthquakes, that whole series of earthquakes. Yeah, both monitors not being reported. I'll pull this over for you. You can see this other one. I'll show you a little west thumb next, but I just wanted to show you that these are showing up on multiple monitors. Now, Panther, that's way up north. It's got its whole own little thing going on over there as the magma stretches out and moves kind of a northeast direction. Going back to that series of earthquakes that they are not reporting. So here we have the 15th. We got one marked in red. This is at uh, 9 minutes and 25 seconds uh, between that and 30 seconds after midnight. Here we have another one marked in red. And let's look at the signature. We got two more there, two more there, and we'll go down to those blobs that I was talking about. Another one marked in red. Yeah, the computer believes they're earthquakes. And when they show up on multiple sites, yeah, you know they are. So, um, yeah, I showed you that one. All right, so here we got the 15th again. Um, did I show you these already? I had to stop and do my wash. I'm doing laundry today. Um, now this is the 14th, 19, 17, and 25 seconds. Did they report that? Yes, a 1.2 it looks like. Um, they got 19, 18, and 46 seconds. Looks like we got three in a row. 19, 18, and 50 seconds, 19, 20, 19, 53, and 19, 17. And I don't think I went back that far to 16, 39. All right, 19, 20. There's the signature of it. The one at 19, uh, 25. All right, so this looks like the larger one. 1917 that would be a 1.5 now that's down here by Heart Lake I believe I reported on on those another one down there by um, Heart Lake and this one was up by Heben Lake there was another tiny one at 22 27 and 30 seconds a little tiny microquake yeah really tiny tiny and then we got that let's look at that signature yeah probably um, harmonic tremors more likely and then another teeny tiny one let's take a look at this let me pull this up oh, hold on all right we'll come down kind of review what we we're looking at The roads are still closed until um, April. Then they'll gradually start opening them up. Um, about a year ago, um, the government wanted someone to be there uh, monitoring Yellowstone 24-7. But nothing ever came of that. You know, heaven forbid this thing decides to unzip, erupt during a time of um, some kind of national holiday or a weekend. It's like this has been a four-day weekend with the President's Day. At least a four-day weekend for the kids being out of school, at least here. Um, so all these other quakes are not being reported. Yeah, like I said, heaven forbid something happens during a holiday. All right, here we have the monitor for Little West Thumb. This is uh, one of the little arms that dips down um, there at Yellowstone Lake um, going south. And we can see these little earthquakes here. Yeah, like I said, again, none of these were reported, even though they're in red. See that? These are all today harmonic tremors. Yeah, we got that spreading that's going on. We got another one up here. Um, 154. 
not being reported. Lots of small microquakes. Lots of them. Sometimes when they come back from the weekends or the vacations, um, they do report the earthquakes, but not always. Stop it! Let's see here. Let's go up. Yeah, blobs of makeup. Now this one here, they did report, and this one, this is the um, the 15th, um, or the 14th, excuse me. Then on the 15th, of course, none of them are being reported for the following, following days because it's President's Day. talking about incompetence those that are in power yeah people have talked about how dark the steam is coming up this is beehive yeah look how dirty that is it never used to be that when uh, many of you were younger all right here we have panther which is up by Gardner which is near the border there of Montana yeah, a lot's been going on there. Like I said, we got the spreading harmonic tremors, drum beats. This is very significant. Yeah, drum beats. Very significant. See that? It's kind of like lava going through a tube. Well, it is lava going through a tube, and it's blocked. And as it comes up, it pushes. Think of a water hose or some pipe with um, an obstacle and it's being slowly shoved through as pressure builds. Boom, 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 boom. Yeah, and then this is what I wanted to show you here. I want to pull it over so you can see the dates here. Yeah, a lot of gases coming up look at that now this has been going on for a while at um, at Panther which is the vault here we have the thumbnails you can see here through the dates how, how it started okay it wasn't going on at the beginning of this year and then all of a sudden it started me pull this forward a little bit and it's been getting more and more significant yeah it makes you wonder what's going on uh, when the data is not coming in, it's been removed, whatever. See the difference from last year? And I'm going to go back to last year if I can. There we go. Yeah, something was going on in December. Let me pull this down for you so you can see. There we go. Yeah, nothing. Not like what's been going on. And I'm going to go back another month. See, we had multiple days when there was nothing going on and then and then days when things going on not like what's showing now October last year yeah there was an uptick yeah look at all marked in red and then it settled down will it settle down again I don't know September of last year see we got one two three four five six days and then we got some activity you know, and then multiple days when nothing was going on. And then June of last year. Yeah, this is one of the days. But yeah, look at all the activity that was going on in June. Excuse me, this is July. And I believe this is August. Yeah, um, is the data being removed because we're seeing that type of activity again there? This is from the 7th. And going into the 8th of this month. This here is the 12th of this month. It almost looks like a geyser went off. This is typically a, a signature when um, Steamboat Geyser goes off. See, this is the 12th when Steamboat Geyser went off. Over here is Mountain Time. Over here is Universal Time. So this would be Mountain Time on the 12th. Here we have January 9th, January 23rd, and we'll look at um, the 1st. See, that's the signature when Steamboat went off. So what, so what the heck is going on with Panther? 
Yeah, they haven't told us anything new. Do they have a new geyser up there somewhere that hasn't been discovered because, you know, the roads are closed and no one's up there? But this has been going on off and on since at least last year. I can only go back to, uh, I believe it's July and August to get the files. Um, we need answers to what's going on there. Yeah, drum beats. Magma on the move. Very significant. So that's all I have for you right now. If any thoughts or comments or questions, yeah, more dead trees over here. Uh, please put it down below. Thank you for your support. Thank you for subscribing. Please stay safe. And I will talk to you later. God bless you. Bye.